guys. So we're at the Stinger booth and we're here with Josh. And Josh is going to tell us a little bit about this machine. Now, I've been talking to some other landscapers and we've been wondering about how this is going to do on heels, especially for bigger guys. Uh, so, you know, we've all seen BNB have this machine. He's had it for a while. Not only have they did made some changes since the version that BNB had, they put a bigger engine on this thing and put a Honda engine on it. So this is one of the new upgrades. They're going to upgrade some tines on this since they've been doing a lot of uh, samples getting figuring out exactly what times are going to work best for different areas so they've got that change coming as well so uh, tell us a little bit about this what's the weight capacity on this and are we going to have any issues with somebody my size on the back of this corner yeah so like you said we upgraded the engine for this year it's uh 40 pounds heavier with just the engine and garments uh, Exactly. Uh, to make it easier, plus not only simplified, but if you're used to running a zero turn, guys, each it drives just like a zero turn mower. Each time each, has its each own time handle. is driven independently, and you can go forward reverse on either side. So you can zero you can zero turn with it. We don't recommend that while the times are down, but you can do nice sweeping turns with it. Uh, again, like you said, there's two transmissions up front. Each tire is driven independently along with the tines. So how do you exactly, if you wanted to put this down, yep. uh, well, how would we go about doing something? Very like simple. This? Lower it into the ground. Once okay. you're in the yard, there's no reason to bring those tines back up until you're done. Not like the old side aerators. Set this thing in the ground, do your aeration, when you're done, pick it up out of the ground, load it on your trailer, go to the next yard. That looked really good. Yeah, very that easy. looked way easier than having it. Yeah jump while you pull or something right. so so y'all got the 24 inch yep then people know you for the 36 inch stand on as well right now y'all are just releasing a 30 inch right now you've got a 24 and a 36 what made y'all want to come out with a 30 inch having the best of both worlds already pretty much right um, so the 36 inch is 59 inches overall so it'll go through a 60 inch gate a lot of people are like, hey, we need, we need that size, intermediate size. All right, what gate do you need to go through? 48. All right, let's do a 47 inch fly machine so we can get you through those 48 inch gates and be as productive as that 36 inch. So, how wide is this one? This one is 35 yeah. inches. So, for your 36, 36 inch gates, if you have a lot of 36 inch match. gates you got to get through, then apparently this is going to be a lot of inch more than you want to do. 48 inch gates or bigger. This is, this is the machine, and if you actually got no gates or bigger properties with bigger gates, then uh, of course the uh, 36 over there is going to be probably your go-to. So I want to thank Josh for giving us all this helpful information. I know me and some guys was talking about these this morning, uh, wondering how they worked on hills, how well they were going to work with bigger guys. What's the, what's the actual weight of one of these? 400 pounds. And what's the weight capacity that this will pull? Man, you can probably put you can probably put a guy 400 pounds on the back of the thing and it'll pull him off. Sweet, yeah, awesome. So you can't beat that, guys. And price-wise, if you're looking for an aerator and you do a lot of aeration, then pretty much this walk behind is probably going to be the one you look at. If you do a ton of aerations and you're used to like the Toro 30, something like that you may be looking at the Stinger 36 or the Stinger 30. So go give them a check out. Where can they find you at online? We're at www.stingerequipment.com. Stingerequipment.com, guys. Check them out. Thanks for watching. See you soon.